Greetings, welcome to Ready API, an integrated suite of applications for API testing. This video will explain how to transfer data between responses and requests in your tests. When do you need this? For example, when you add an object to the services database, a service usually sends an identifier for this object within the response. You then use the identifier to view this object later and modify it when needed. Let's try this in Ready API. Here's a project that works with the sample pet store API. It contains a test case with two requests. The first request adds information on a pet to the database, and the second one retrieves the data using the pet's ID. Let's send the first request now. We received a response which contains the ID of the newly added pet. We need this ID to run the second request. Let's command Ready API to retrieve the ID from the response by selecting the Get Data option in the context menu. In the dialog, we select the needed test step and its property. Our response contains a JSON object, so the special dialog appears. It shows all the JSON data of the response. We need the pet ID. The expression that has just appeared in the value column is called the property expansion. It starts with the dollar sign and contains the path to the source property within the current test case. You can use property expansions throughout Ready API to refer to needed properties. Let's run the request now. The request that we have just sent to the service contains a proper pet ID. The response contains information about the pet, so the service works as expected. From now on, every time you run the whole test case, the second request will use the effective pet ID from the response to the first request. Let's see which properties we can call with the property expansions. Look to the bottom left. There is the REST Request Properties tab. Every item in a project, a test step, test case, test suite, even the project itself, has its own set of custom properties. Additionally, you can create global properties. Such properties can be referred from anywhere in Ready API even in Load UI Pro or Service V Pro. With property expansions, you can create shortcuts to any of these properties to transfer information between test steps, responses, and requests. As an alternative to property expansions, you can use the property transfer test step to pass data between test steps. Let's add one to our test case. Note the location of the step is important. It should be located between the source step and the target step. In this test step, you can create multiple property assignments. Let's create an assignment right now. We specify the source property and the path language. Our request has already ran, so we can access the previous response right now. Let's select the pet ID and specify the target location. Now we run the transfer. To make sure everything works properly, we switch to the get request and it already contains the new value. This concludes our short tutorial on transferring data between operations in Ready API. Thank you for watching.